Hey everybody, Bill and Deb. Hi there. <laughs> well, it's a beautiful afternoon, so we thought we would go on a leisurely bike ride today. And of course, we thought we would take you all along with us. Gonna check out another part of the uh, wonderful uh, bike trails that they have here in the Northwest Arkansas area. Gonna try to take full advantage of those while we're here. <laughs> Cause we will be leaving here before too awful long. Yep. And uh, you know, he'll be heading north and uh, gonna go see some areas we've never seen before. And we're gonna take you guys along as we do that. But real briefly, let's talk right quick about the, the direction our channel is going. We wanna reassure folks that the walkthrough videos will continue. We will continue to do walkthrough videos. Isn't that right? Yes. Yeah. And when it comes to reviews on products, what we try to do, we have companies reach out to us all the time wanting us to do reviews on products and we don't take on every little product that no. comes along if well, we, we did we can't <laughs> yeah we, we just can't do it but what we try to do we try to uh, go with the products that uh, we think would be a value to our viewers and also you know make sure it's something that we could use as well yes because we feel if we can use it uh, in the lifestyle that we are going with right now then surely someone else that lives a similar lifestyle can use the same product. I mean, it's very simple. That's why we do what we do. So anyway, <laughs> everybody's been saying ever since they saw our bike riding videos, y'all need to wear helmets, y'all need to wear helmets. Well, yeah. we never wore helmets with our regular yeah. pedal bikes. Yeah, of course these things will go a lot faster. But these than... are, <laughs> this is yeah. another animal. <laughs> so yeah, and we agree. So well, why don't you go ahead and pop that on, babe? And, uh, Click it there. If I can remember how, it's pretty simple. Yeah, you'll figure it out in a minute. It's, um, We've only put them on two or three times. Yeah. Well, there. There you go. <laughs> it's not difficult. <laughs> no, it's not difficult at all. Now turn around and show them. Uh, these are pretty cool helmets, in my opinion. Now this company did reach out to us. Now these, uh, these helmets come from a company called Exnito. That's X-N-I-T-O, I do yeah, believe. I believe so. And these are uh, specifically designed to handle higher speeds. Right. They're rated up to uh, uh, a crash at 28 miles an hour. Yes. Yeah. And no, I'm not going to demonstrate a crash. No, we're not going to demonstrate a crash. <laughs> um, and we're not going to go into great detail about the specs. This is not a review video for these helmets. But what we are going to do is we're going to, you know, go on a ride with them today. And then we'll do a regular review video here in the next few days, you know. But there are a lot of pretty cool features about this. For one thing, got a little headlight up here. Turn around in the back, babe. Oh. And, uh, yeah, you got it. And you've got a, uh, you, you can go three different modes there. Hit it again, see what, yeah. And then hit it one more time. And that turns it off. Hit it one more time again. Let me do it. And they may not be able to see it there right now, but uh, anyway, and then you got there. That's the one I wanted to get. You can also do a steady glow one, and uh, then you can do that type. So to make you visible, and we've got a saying that uh, cars want to kill you. Yeah, and and it's rechargeable. <laughs> yeah, it is. There's a USB-C port back there, but we'll go into a lot more yeah. detail about that when we do the actual review. In the meantime, go ahead and look at the link. You know, we'll post the link in the description and you can read all the specs about them and everything. And we're even gonna include a discount code if you decide you wanna go ahead and order one, mm -hmm. right? Yes. Yeah, so uh, that's cool about it. Now, Deb got the medium size. I'm gonna get mine right quick and I'm gonna show you what it looks like with me. Um, and I'll be right back. Hang on to the camera, dear. You hang on to the camera. All right, now they're gonna see me without my, without my uh, hat on. They're gonna see me without my hat on momentarily. Now, the one thing I wanna mention, Deb wears a medium size and I wear a very big hat. I have a big head, don't I? Yes. Now, I wear a seven and three quarter hat and well, I got the biggest one they have, which was a uh, extra large. I believe so. I believe so. And. It fits me. Yep. Yeah. Fits me pretty darn good. And it's very, very comfortable. 
these are the main things that we wanted to point out. I'm still trying to get the hang of how this thing hooks. I'm not going to worry about it right now. <laughs> the main thing I wanted to point out right now is that it does fit guys with big heads. Okay? Yep. All right. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and get this strap done and hooked up, and we're going to take you all on a ride. Be right back. This is one of our favorite trails. When we lived here in this area, we would come to this trailhead often. Oh, and by the way, right after I turned the camera off, I was able to click my chin strap in about a half a second. <laughs> Does this bring back any memories, dear? Oh, yeah. How's your helmet feel? Feels good when I'm moving. I'm sorry, I couldn't hear you. I said when I'm moving, it feels good. Okay. When I wasn't moving, it was a little warm. Well, yeah. That's what the air holes are for. I've tried on regular bike helmets in the past. Long you left. And wearing a regular style bike helmet, I think I look like a dork. I look like a dork enough in a helmet. <laughs> but I don't feel like I look quite as dorky in this helmet. That's just me. Do I look less dorky in this helmet, dear? You look great. Oh. <laughs> okay. Boy, this bike just wants to go. We're going 12 miles an hour right now. 11, 12 miles an hour. I'm in like fourth or, uh, I think I'm in fifth gear. You know, these bike trails here in Northwest Arkansas are absolutely fabulous. Like we said in the past, they keep adding tributaries to them. You can go just about anywhere. You know, to restaurants, Grocery shopping, regular shopping, on your bike. It's really cool. Really cool. Two. Two. 
Try it in two, okay. I'm still in one. Let's see what happens. Oh yeah. No sweat. No sweat. And which way you want to go, babe? To the right. Okay. This will take us down all along the golf course here. Deb and I, we've kind of started a new program. Here before long, we're going to start, uh, well, Deb's already doing it. She's weighing in every day, checking her blood sugar every day. I'm checking my blood sugar, of course, every day. And uh, here shortly, I'm going to start weighing in every day. And we're going to, I have a goal to lose quite a few pounds between now and we're still in the month of May. I have a goal to lose. How many pounds do you think I ought to try to lose, dear, between now and the rendezvous in October? At least 20. 20? At least. Well, surely I can lose 20 between now and October. Hopefully we'll do more, but we'll set the goal for 20 pounds. How's that? Set the goal to lose 20 pounds. So you will see us riding our bikes more. Whenever we have the opportunity, we're going to be kayaking more when there's, you know, some place that we really want to go kayaking. restaurants along the way on up here as well and there's a rabbit <laughs> it wasn't too far a few years ago when I was out riding right in here somewhere a bobcat came jumping out of the out of the weeds over there and ran in front of me for a little while This is awesome. This is so awesome.
for a better day to go bike riding. No, it's not real hot. No, sun peaks out now and then. Yeah. Not very yeah. many people out yet. No, which makes it nice. Yep. Especially when we're still learning the ropes on these bikes yeah, and stuff. Yeah, when we're still getting <laughs> confidence. <laughs> you look really cute in your helmet, by the way. Yes. Yeah. How do I look? Uh, huh? Absolutely fantastic. <laughs> okay. Well, you Whatever know, you say. We look really dorky with a major head injury. Yeah. So, yeah, we'll that's just true. Keep with the helmets. <laughs> anyway, we will be doing an in-depth review and talking about all its features and everything these helmets have. But uh, right now, all I can say is, you know, I've I've got a big head. I wear a seven and three quarter hat regularly, and uh, this helmet feels really nice on me. And a lot of these helmets that I tried on, you know, they didn't. Plus, I look dorky in them, and I don't look quite as dorky in this one. I hope. Like I said, huh? it's immaterial. It's immaterial, yeah. But uh, uh, very comfortable. But we'll go ahead and do an in-depth review, you know, on this here in a few days. Yeah. Uh, still got a couple more doctor's appointments. Got to get taken care of. <laughs> <laughs> and then we'll be hitting the trail uh, before too long and heading north. And uh, we've actually got at least one cargo trailer conversion walkthrough to do. Yeah. Before we leave. And maybe two. Maybe two. We'll Let's find see. out. Yeah, so we'll be doing that before we go and um, then we'll be moseying north and we're going to stop off at some friends for a little while. They're going to help us put our receiver hitch on the back of the trailer and build it uh, tough enough to handle the abuse from being at the very back of the trailer. And we're also going to mount a spare tire rack back there. Woo -woo, don't have to carry these things inside the trailer. We're anymore. also going to be staining the floors. <laughs> yes. Actually be sanding the floors and then staining stain. them and then going with uh, polyacrylic coatings. To protect them. Several several coatings. We'll be doing that. What else are we gonna be doing? Build a new toilet seat? Well, yeah, but I've got a track to hang above the shower, yeah. for the shower curtain. She's been making a list, folks. I've got a, I've got a uh, towel bar to hang by my new bathroom sink. Of course. Yeah. Oh, and kitchen cabinet doors. Yeah, I've got a doors and drawer drawer facings. Yeah. So our goal is while we're up there north at this friend's done. place to get all this done. And we'll be, of course, videoing the whole thing and taking you along, showing you how we do it. Yeah. And who knows? We might get the trailer done enough so we can actually do a walkthrough on our trailer. On our own? On our own. How quaint. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. We're going to let you go for now. We're going to rest here for a second and just chill. And then we're going to hop on these bikes and head back to the van. We'll end up riding about 14, 15 miles all together today. And exercise is good. Exercise is yep. wonderful. And then we're going to be, you know, keeping track of our weights. I don't know if Deb would be quite ready to reveal her weight yet. <laughs> I weigh a lot less than you. 
Well, this is true. <laughs> I hope so. That's my review. Anyway, <laughs> this is Bill and Deb with I Ride Tiny House Adventures, and uh, we'll see you again soon. Right? Yes. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.